One look at an old high school yearbook is all it takes to see how far eyewear has come. It was a time when to wear glasses was considered more of a sentence than a fashion statement. Fortunately, that was then. Today, wearing glasses is considered high fashion, and nowhere is this more evident than in Hollywood. Stars love glasses so much, they even pose for ads selling them. Glasses come in thousands of styles and can cost thousands of dollars. Many go shopping even if they don't need glasses to see. They just want to be seen. When you talk to somebody, you talk to their face, not their shirt or their shoes or their jacket. And that if you want to wear glasses, that the eyeglasses are the fashion and the clothing is the accessory. Now, regular folk can come to the store. But what about stars who relish their privacy? Not to worry. Hollywood has someone named Cheryl Schumann, a well-to-do optician who got an idea from a client named Michael Jackson. He asked me if I could start coming to his home, and I thought, wow, this is a great idea for business. There were a lot of actors out there uh, that needed a service. And so Cheryl Schumann began making house calls with a business she named Starry Eyes. I brought all different kinds of styles so you can get an idea of something more conservative, something more fashionable. Certainly the privacy is nice, but actors like David Bradley count on Cheryl professionally. This time I'm playing an owner of an apparel company, so I thought a pair of glasses would help me get into character. Cheryl Schumann offers a variety of styles that help define a character. After all, the eyes are the first thing people look at. Before Cheryl came along, costume designers would run all over town tracking down the right look. Not anymore. Now they can simply call me. I go in. I have up to, you know, 4,000 frames that they can choose from. We have a detailed description of the character, what they're looking for. We have all their prescription information, and we can do everything right then and there in the middle of a production meeting. Among her many credits, Top Gun, Ghostbusters, Back to the Future 2, Harlem Nights. For television, her glasses complement the beauty of Candace Bergen on Murphy Brown. Some of her clients are so happy with the choices she makes for their on-camera look, they keep them. Cheryl Schumann does quite well herself, thank you. Studios and actors pay a lot for the convenience of her services. Just take a recent film as a for instance. And for that one project, it was 36000 and some odd dollars. So, yeah, and when you're working on 40, 50 projects a month, it's nice. Nice for a Midwesterner who, if you told her 15 years ago that today she'd be selling eyewear to the stars, she'd say you were crazy. I grew up in a town of 300 people. So uh, you, you dream of someday maybe going to a concert and maybe seeing one of these people from thousands of yards away. But uh, I get to work with these people every single day and not only work with them, but right eye to eye. And it's, it's really great. Only in Hollywood, I'm Peter Jones.